Exercise 1. Buddha showing a thousand hands. Buddha showing a thousand hands is the first set of Falun Dafa exercises. The core of this exercise is stretching to open up all the channels. Beginners can quickly gain energy after practicing this exercise. Regular practitioners can quickly improve. At the very beginning, this exercise can enable practitioners to practice at a very high level and to have all of their channels open up very quickly. The movements of this exercise are quite simple. The Great Way features simplicity and ease. Although the movements are simple, on the macro level, they control what is to be practiced by the entire exercise. When learning and practicing Buddha showing a thousand hands, one's body will feel hot and the energy field is very strong. This is caused by stretching and opening all the energy channels in the whole body. Its purpose is to unblock areas where the energy is blocked, to enable energy to circulate freely and smoothly, to stimulate the energy within the body and under the skin circulating it vigorously, and to absorb a great amount of the energy of the universe. At the same time, it enables practitioners to quickly enter the state of Qigong energy field. This exercise is practiced as the foundation exercise of Falun Dafa, and is usually done first. It is one of the methods to strengthen cultivation practice. It is preferred to do it three times continuously. Let's watch Master Lee teach Buddha showing a thousand hands. Preparation Stand naturally with the feet shoulder width apart, keep the whole body relaxed but not too loose, bend both legs slightly. Keep the knees and the hips relaxed. Hold the lower jaw in slightly. The tip of the tongue touches the upper palate. Leave a little space between the teeth. Close the lips and gently shut the eyes. The face has a serene expression. Hands move to follow along the mechanism. Both hands are in the lotus posture. Follow this preparation for the other exercises. Jie Yin Raise both hands. Keep the palms facing up. The thumb tips slightly touch each other. Join the other four fingers and overlap on each other. Males, left hand is on top. Females, right hand is on top. Form an oval shape. Hold the lower abdomen area. Both upper arms are slightly forward with two elbows up so the armpits are open. During the exercises, the hands are within 10 centimeters or 3 inches from the body. Slowly raise the hands from Jie Yin, conjoined hands posture. While raising the hands, straighten both legs gradually. When the hands reach the front of the face, separate them and gradually turn the palms upwards. When the hands are above the top of the head, the centers of the palms face up. The fingers of both hands point to each other. At this time, Push the head upward, press the feet down, and straighten the whole body. Press up hard with the base of both palms. Stretch the body for about 2 to 3 seconds. Then release the whole body into a relaxed state. Turn both palms outwards until reaching the front side of the head. Flex the wrist and move them down. When the hands reach the front of the chest, the palms face the chest at a distance of about 10 centimeters or 3 inches. When reaching the lower abdomen area, turn the back of the hands to face each other. Then lift the hands up to the chest and he shu. Press the hands together. When doing he shu, fingers and the base of the palms are pressed against each other. Hold the elbows up with the forearms in a straight line. Separate the hands as if holding a ball and turn them in opposite directions. Males turn the left hand towards the chest, females turn the right hand towards the chest, so that the left hand is on top for the male, the right hand is on top for the female. 
then extend the elbow and arm diagonally upwards. The palm faces down and is slightly higher than the head. Male, right hand, female, left hand, still at the chest, with palms facing up. After the arm is extended, gradually straighten up the whole body. Push the head upward, press the feet downward. Stretch hard for about two to three seconds. Then release the whole body. Move both hands to her shi in front of the chest. Repeat the previous movements with the opposite hands. Move both hands to her shi in front of the chest. From her shi, extend the arms towards the sides of the body, forming a straight line with the shoulders. Gradually straighten up the whole body. Push the head upwards. Press both feet downwards. Stretch both arms for about two to three seconds. Release the whole body. Move the hands to her shi in front of the chest. While separating hands, extend them down towards the lower front. Keep the two arms parallel and straight. The angle between arms and body is about 30 degrees. Straighten up the whole body. Push the head upwards. Press the feet downwards. Stretch hard for about two to three seconds. Immediately release the whole body. Move the hands to her shi in front of the chest. Separate both hands and move them diagonally to the sides of the body. Extend the arms forming an angle of about 30 degrees with the body. At this time push the head upwards, press the feet downwards. Stretch hard for about 2 to 3 seconds. Release the whole body. Move both hands to her shi in front of the chest. Separate the hands and move them to the back of the body, with both palms turning towards the back. When the arms reach the sides of the back, straighten up the whole body. Push the head upwards, press the feet downwards. Stretch hard for about two to three seconds. Release the whole body. Move hands to her shi in front of the chest. Separate the hands and push forwards with the palms. The fingers point up. The arms and shoulders are at the same level. When the arms are extended, push the head upwards Press the feet downwards. Stretch hard for about two to three seconds. Release the whole body. Move the hands to her shi in front of the chest. Slowly move the hands downwards, turning the palms towards the abdomen area. When the hands reach the lower abdomen area, overlap the hands. For males, the left hand is inside. For females, the right hand is inside. The palm of one hand faces the back of the other. The distance between the hands and between the hand and the lower abdomen is about 3 centimeters or 1 inch. Overlap for a while, then jie yin. <laughs>